Hello everyone, it's Karen here and I have a mixed media step-by-step -step layout tutorial for scrap berries using their Birds of Paradise collection. Enjoy! First I use a vine stencil and some light molding paste to create texture on the background. Let the first layer dry and then I added some more vines on some other areas to create more texture. Since I knew I was going to spray onto the background, I sealed the background with some clear gesso. I had forgotten to do this step before, so after I stenciled, I just used some clear gesso to cover the page. Then using a different stencil with a flower pattern and light molding paste, I decided to add some more texture onto the background. Then I started to add some color. I used the Lindy Stamp Gang Sunset Pink to just add a little bit of shimmer to the background. Then I used the Color Bloom Peony to add some more darker colors. I dry that layer and then I use shimmers, bed of roses and pop art pink to add even more shades to the background. Once the color was dry, I used a wipe to just remove some of the color over the stencil to bring out the pattern in the background. I cut out a few images from the Birds of Paradise birds and plume papers and I used them on the background to mat my photo. white flowers to embellish the page and I also use scrap berries fairy tale resin pieces to add some more dimension
I used some dimensional tape under the photo to mat it and I also used Fabri-Tac to glue the flowers and the resins. felt like it needed some more pink or coral flowers, so I added some more randomly to the page. I also added a title from the Around the World Scrapberry Collection. Use a little bit of gesso to just highlight some of the flowers and papers. Then I diluted with water so I could brush it lightly on the background to blend it all in. It muted all the colors and made it look as if the background is part of the picture. some splatters so I used some white watercolor paint to add some splatters around the page. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you want to see more of my work please visit my blog or the Scrapberry blog for more design team inspiration.